why does Mr. Henderson deserve to be Teacher of the Year? As an administrator, I probably reflect most deeply on Kyle as not only a teacher leader, but a leader of teachers, and I see that as two very distinct things. It's one thing to lead events that strongly impact kids. It's another thing to be able to bring all the grown-ups along with you and to have people buy in, and he can do that. Mr. Henderson is a joy to work with, with the students, with the adults. Um, he's so funny. He brings out all the joy and learning for everybody. He keeps us on his toes because there are so many things that we have going on at school, and he just makes sure that we're, we're on it and we're having a great time and just love the, love the joy of learning. Mr. Henderson has been deserving Teacher of the Year for several years now and I'm so excited for him being nominated and selected this year. He's very creative and he thinks outside of the box. He has a way of engaging the students in unique and creative ways and does a fabulous job of just bringing um, education to life for the students. He is really nice. He he will always be one of my favorite teachers. He doesn't just care about you in school. He cares about your personal life, and he's one of the teachers who'll come to like all your sports games, and who's who will just you know help you with all your stuff if you're confused. And we just appreciate all of his hard work. He does so many things for our school and so many things for our fifth grade English language arts teachers that it's so helpful to have someone with his personality and his spunk that just brings all the joy of learning to us as well. He always is helping a lot. He never really stops helping. So Kyle's leadership role on a school-wide basis has always been dedicated to that fifth to sixth transition, something that no one else in the building could bring, but Kyle could. So there are events that are scheduled throughout the year that he um, orchestrates and builds so that kids leave us having built those skill sets of stronger organization and management skills, that especially that time and material management, how to work a locker combination, the things that are scary when you get there, so that the spring of fifth grade is always dedicated to the getting ready. When we had what people originally called the dusting of 2014, which turned out to be anything but. That afternoon I found myself making decisions that I'd never been put in the position to make before. And Kyle came up to me at a certain point and said, hey, Dr. L, you're making very unique situational decisions. And I wanna tell you that there's a strong group of the faculty that's gonna stay the night here with you. So why don't you let us take some things off your plate that you don't have to think about because you're making decisions in the now. Who thinks like that from a classroom perspective? They're all strong leaders, but Kyle thinks bigger picture than that. I think to me as an administrator, instead of commenting on his very effective classroom management and the way in which he delivers instruction, I wanted to highlight both his roles as teacher leader and then leaders of our teachers, for which I'm very appreciative and I enjoy so much working with him as a person and a leader. Hey Kyle Henderson, I'm so glad that you continue to be a part of this faculty family. I just got to formally describe you in two ways that matter a great deal to me as the lead administrator at this school. Um, I get to make a lot of decisions, but I also carry the responsibility in the end. And I know that when you step up into your leadership roles that you embrace it and you share that with me. And that means a great deal to me that you can see that big picture both as a teacher leader and then as a leader of teacher and those bigger picture events. Thank you, Kyle. Okay, so hey, Kyle. Um, I just am so appreciative of everything you've done for me coming back this year. Um, you have just taken me under and just pulled me aside and made sure that we're always on the same page of keeping everything together with ELA for fifth grade and making sure our kids are learning and having a joy in that. And I can't thank you enough of how much you've taken on with camp 
I know that was such an, um, a challenge and you just took it with ease and stride and I can't thank you enough for that. And you just, you make me feel like I can be a better teacher and that's so important to have somebody like that and just being on the same page all year long, no matter what. So I appreciate you and congratulations, you deserve it. Kyle, you know that you are one of my dearest friends. You know that I feel like I can share my heart with you and whether we agree or disagree on topics, I know that we can always share our hearts and we have a common love for students and a common love for the world. And I'm so thankful to not only be a, a teacher here at the school with you, but to be your partner. And I hope that we're able to stay that way for a long time or until you retire. Thank you so much, Mr. Anderson. This is this year so far has been such a good year. Thank you, Mr. Anderson. You're awesome.